Head Coach Ross of the Attack Gym, responding to a number of emails I received, uh, questions about uh, the flying squirrel, Gabrielle Douglas, the, one of the outstanding uh, gymnasts representing the USA in the uh, Final Five. They're called the Final Five because after this Olympics, the rules will prevent five athletes who are gymnasts uh, from representing their country in uh, the Olympics from that point forward. Okay, here's what I have to say about this. First of all, congratulations to everyone in the Olympics. Whether you medaled or not, no matter what country you went, you went through, because that you're a special person. Very, very, very few human beings in the history of humanity will be able to even hope to aspire to achieve what you've done. So congratulations to you right away. Now let's jump into the situation regarding uh, Gabrielle Douglas, the flying squirrel, okay? There is these controversies put up, especially about the one picture wherein she doesn't put her hand over her heart, and uh, others uh, controversies wherein uh, some sisters, my, my beautiful black women, you know, apparently were dissing her hair, were saying things disrespectful about her hair. It's, it's ridiculous, it's ridiculous. Absolutely without any cause or justification, all right? First of all, Notice how sexist and racist that the, the yeah. distinction is, you know, between who's getting sweated and putting her, their hands on the heart or not. Michael Phelps, you know, the most decorated uh, athlete, Olympic athlete of all time, literally laughed his way through, the, uh, through the, 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 the anthem. And no one said a word to him. He laughed his way through it while he's talking to someone else on video. No one said a word to it. Your boy, Donald the Hair Piece Trump, you know, in you know, in front of a in front of a, a, a Republican National Convention, wherein he was debating his other brain dead uh, Republican uh, cohorts, didn't didn't did, he stood up in the front line with everyone right on the desk, or I mean, right on the uh, right on the, the, the stage, and had his hands to the side and was looking bored, while everyone else had their hands up across their heart and what have you. No one whispered a single word about that, but the split second Gabby Douglas does it. Oh, wait a minute, the internet wants to break. It's ridiculous. Those who are trying to break the internet behind you, you're probably racist. If you're not, then you're exceptionally ignorant. And if you're not either one of those two, you're both. How you like that? Okay, now, you asked me what my, what my opinion was upon this matter even further, and it's very, very simple. The issues about her hair. Stop it. Her hair is beautiful and so is the rest of her. She's achieved things that very, very, very few human beings in the excruciatingly demanding uh, sport of gymnastics, especially for women, can hope to achieve. She made history. The first black woman and the first American woman, period, to win the gold all around as a gymnast. You can hate all you like, but you can't erase that, okay? As far as I'm concerned, that alone, that feat alone puts her in the, 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 the halls of the greatest that we should always respect. Lastly, I noticed that if you pay attention of the, to the actual makeup of the final five, you discover that four are people who are of diversity, all right? Simone Biles, Hernandez, Gabby Douglas, and, and Ali Rasmus, Rasm who they call mom, right? Now, notice how we don't see a four, the four of them together in any picture. We don't even see the three sisters of colors, Hernandez, Biles, and Douglas, together in pictures and promoted as such. We should, especially those of us, anyone of good heart, anyone who loves the sport, anyone who, had, who has any form of sense whatsoever, should pay attention to that and realize that this is the, the media manipulating us through a holdover method of, 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 of of, uh, of reporting the news in a racist and slanted way. It's very subtle, but it's very racist, it's very specific. Notice also that since Gabby Douglas was caught up in wherever hell it is, you know, Pledge Gate or something, I don't know, all right, uh, that she was not so subtly moved to the side, and both Ali and Kosian were plugged in to the star that is Simone Biles. That should that that should that should that should make you like like Arsenio Hall used to say that those are things that that make you go hmm that should really make you pause and think about what you're talking about and what we're seeing here and how racist much of this this coverage still is 
I'm not even gonna get into Lochte, not at this video, but you know I'm going to get to it later, okay? So, focus here. Recognize we, as good people, and we especially as good people of color, need to get off that stupid stuff, recognize that Gabby is extraordinary, she's magnificent, she's lovely, and she's only just starting in her life. She has so much more that, with which to electrify the world with. Stop hating, start embracing. Head Coach Ross with the tax gym, Asante Sane, Ashi.